Hello my friends and welcome back. In this video I'm going to show you how to create the emulators, Android virtual devices. So open Android Studio and go up, click on this, these three um, points, virtual device manager, and you will get this screen. Then click on create device and you can select a list of devices here so i prefer not obligatory prefer using nexus 6 because it has, has a good dimension and resolutions okay i you can select tv uh, aware os tablet automotive but we are going and interested in the phones select nexus 6 click on next and now you need to download the latest really uh, the latest system image there is a button here i i have already downloaded with the android studio set up there is a button called download in blue like this it should be appears like uh, here near to api 33 if it is not uh, appearing like this then you if you then you are ready to use this image sometimes you have some errors here please if you have any error please uh, list it below and i will show you how to solve it click on next then you can name your avd name naming here from nexus 6 i will keep it you can change some settings for it but i am uh, good with this uh, these settings click on finish and this is the emulator if i click on this run button it will launch the emulator and here we go our emulator is ready now to operate with android studio i will show you another way to start the avd in android studio uh, until it launches, I will uh, I will show you how to create a new project. I will keep it as an empty activity. I will name it as emulator app. I will click on finish. I'm just showing you a demo how to use the Android Android virtual device managers. And here we go. This is the emulator. If you go to here to the upper right corner, you see there are a bunch of uh, buttons. I told you in the previous video there is a device manager button. I click it and you will get this device manager. This device manager will allow you to create the device again or, or select another device or uh, um, or an existing virtual emulator. OK, so this is how we create Android virtual devices. You can create another devices. For example, if I need to use a tablet here. Um, size, let me pick it as eight point. 03 next i need to download for example uh, system version 2 and wait for downloading but i prefer using always this the latest system image click on next click and uh, name it and quick click on finish to create it okay um i'm waiting for android studio to uh, to start uh, start uh, allowing me to edit the code because uh, I'm waiting for the Gradle project sync in progress and our emulator is ready now it's in standby mode I'm just waiting for Android Studio to finish the Gradle build in order to um, to run this application on our virtual device okay so always wait for Gradle in order to sync the projects now it finishes i will click on run select this this uh, running devices 
Nexus 6, or you can connect your uh, physical device. Select the app and click on this red, uh, this uh, green triangle. And I will show you here if I click on this emulator. Waiting for the project to run. By the way, you can check my uh, Udemy course. It's about 87 hours of content app development uh, you can enroll and join uh, thousands of people learning and uh, start, st that they started publishing your uh, their apps so become one of um, of my student on Udemy and you can subscribe uh, to our channel if you like uh, these tutorials and we are building this course it's about 200 or 300 uh, uh, video tutorials so if you want to uh, like these tutorials, just subscribe to get the latest videos and tutorials. Waiting for the emulator. And here we go. Congratulations, guys. You've succeeded in, uh, in running the first application on emulator. So Thank you guys. I hope you subscribe to our YouTube channel and um, join our Udemy courses.